Good afternoon, everybody. Today we have a celebrity chef in the house. We have Marilia Leal, and she is going to be showing us how to make Caesar dressing. So Caesar dressing um, hails from Caesar Cardini, and he originally made Caesar dressing in Tijuana, Mexico at Hotel Caesar. So um, this is her version, and she's going to show us how to make it. Okay, so first we have some mayonnaise. And that's about like a tablespoon of mayonnaise. And that's gonna help emulsify everything. And then we have three egg yolks. And again, um, just a little vinagre. It's the, the eggs that are gonna help emulsify the dressing. And then she's gonna slowly add some, um, this is just basically some white vinegar. And I'm gonna be her, her helper here. All right, so she's kind of slowly adding the vinegar, slowly, slowly, slowly. And then she's gonna add the um, the oil little by little. Okay, okay. So we're gonna drizzle in the oil little by little, little by little to create that emulsion. And she's doing this all by hand. So, this is um, the OG real Miss Leal, all right? Her first name is uh, Medelia, and she is my mother-in-law. I call her mama, all right? And she was telling me that she learned how to make this recipe by watching it on TV. Um, and then she was cooking at a restaurant called The Boat in Toronto, uh, Canada. And once she made it for the chef and all of the clients loved it, she just told me to stop. And now we're gonna add a little bit of vinegar again. All right, and now we're just kind of alternating between the vinegar and the oil, okay? And what she's trying to do is she's trying to keep this emulsion nice and stable. All right. So she might tell me to, no, no, she's adding a little bit of vinegar. Okay, what are you sporting the rest? All right, now we're gonna add the rest. Okay. So in our mortar and pestle, we have crushed two heads, I said that correctly, two heads of garlic, all right, with about a tablespoon of capers. Now, her recipe does not have anchovies. However, if that's something that you like, by all means, uh, and I would add my anchovies to the mortar and pestle so they can get nice and crushed. And then again, that garlic is going to give us some flavor. The capers are going to give us that umami. And that's again, what the anchovies do as well. All right. So this is going to get nice and mixed in. So it's distributed throughout. This Caesar salad is not lacking in flavor, kids. All right. So again, we're alternating again. the vinegar. Again. Now we're gonna slowly, continuously add our oil. So, Snivelly up, when was it um, so cuisinier? I asked her, uh, Miss Leal, how old were you when you first started cooking? Uh, 19. You were, did you do not know about it? Si. Yeah. So she said she was... When I was cooking at a restaurant. Oh, so she started cooking in a restaurant when she was 19 years old. In Kayak, in Sino, a cuisinier. I just asked her, who taught you how to cook? Kayak, what? I learned from my mother and then the experience in the restaurant. Okay, so she said that she learned with her grandma and then she learned through experience in the restaurant. Okay. 
So she's been cooking professionally for 38 years. And uh, she's always been the chef. Nice, nice. And then, um, <laughs> huh? Oh, we had a little correction. It's been almost 60 years they've been um, at it. And they've had several restaurants in Toronto, Canada that they've owned and operated successfully with lots of happy customers. What's your, I just asked her, what's your favorite thing to cook? My favorite cookie. A tua coisa favorita para cozinhar? É o bacalhau avianense. Oh, so she said it's bacalhau oh. avianense, and that's their signature um, dish. So basically, o bacalhau grelhado ou é frito? O bacalhau é, é frito. Okay, so it's um, codfish that's fried, and then she hand cut. Uh, her own potato chips, and then she makes uh, her own special like onion sauce with um, with onions, and it has like a nice sweet but like tangy flavor. And then you have the sweet and salty uh, codfish. It gets topped with that delicious onion sauce, and then. Um, it gets served with a side of those handmade uh, Valila fried hand cut chips. You beef, you steak up to be as a beef. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then she said she also likes to make beef portuguesa. Uh, o que é beef portuguesa, Sr. Leal? It's a nice steak. New York steak. New York steak. In the steak. Vai a fritar, leva um, faz um bolinho especial okay. e depois é servido com, com ovo no top e french fries ardelas. Ok, so we have uh, some sauteed steak with a special sauce that's made on the side. And then uh, uh, a side of fries. And a fried egg on top. O que é a sua coisa para, favorita para comer? I just asked her what's her favorite thing to eat. To eat. Mm -hmm. The peixe. Eu gosto muito do, do revalo. All right, so her favorite thing to eat is some sea bass. So where they live in, in Portugal is they always have a plentiful supply of uh, fish, which uh, they cook and grill outside. All right, so now we're gonna add our kind of flavorings here. Each to uh, this is sugar. All right, so we're just gonna sprinkle that in. Good salt. Uh, how much? That was about like a tablespoon. So she's tasting it. Yeah. And then we're gonna add for sugar to taste. This is probably a teaspoon of salt. All right, and then we're gonna add some Worcestershire sauce, about a tablespoon. So we're just gonna eyeball this. There we go. And then some freshly ground pepper. Again, this is to taste. Good. All right. Tá pronto? Um bocadinho de mostarda ou não? Um bocadinho. Não, 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 não. Okay. All right. Prova, So, um, she says it does not need mustard because there is mustard in the mayonnaise. And then she said prova, which in Portuguese means to taste. Taste. So, we're going to taste it by kind of just dipping um, a little bit of romaine lettuce that's from our garden today into the dressing. And then we'll try it. It's delicious. It's nice and briny. 
It's very garlic forward, but it's beautifully emulsified. It's got some nice texture with the capers and the garlic. Um, and then we're gonna jar it up and we're gonna store it in our refrigerator so we can make our own delicious Caesar dressing. All right. Obrigada, Sr. Leal, de estar conosco a cozinhar hoje. Thank you, mamas, for helping us cook today and teach us how to make some delicious Caesar salad. I love you. I love you too. <laughs>